And the most fascinating thing about this is that the world craves it. The world seeks it, seeks this hope and love and inclusion that we are experiencing here at Calvary by the sea. But you know what? There's so many circles that are missing this. So many churches that are missing this. And we need to reclaim. Listen to me. You need, we need to repair, we need to rescue the church from those who have hijacked our Jesus and our church. Did you think? Using him or the church for political gain, for political votes for white nationalism, using him to justify white supremacy and racism and colonization and homophobia and transphobia, using Jesus and his church and his teachings to mistreat migrant human beings, to exclude queer human beings, to dismiss the environment, to abuse individualistic amendment rights, and to generate unjust laws and bills. You see, the American Christian Church friends, is very, very, very ill. It needs to be rescued. It needs to be repaired. It needs to be reclaimed. But see, without that holy flow, there is no repairing. There is no rescuing. We need the divine in us, around us, in all that we do. And it will make it easier to help others see and believe in resurrection it is our responsibility as the gathered group of people as the church as the mouth and hands and feet of the holy trinity to respond to the cries of injustice making it easier for people to see and believe that our things are being made new